Hi guys, if you'd like to learn something really interesting about what people are saying with their eyes, then stay tuned. My name's Ty, welcome to my channel, thank you for tuning in and let's get started. So today we're going to be touching on the topic of NLP, which is Neuro Linguistic Programming. And basically what that is, is understanding what people are maybe thinking or how they think by their language, eye movement. If you ask someone a question, let's just say if you had 50 grand in cash and you can only spend it on yourself, what will you spend it on? So you ask them this and then watch what they do with their eyes, okay? So we will touch back on this at the end of the video when I've explained what exactly it is you can tell from their eye movements and then you can do this on other people, it's an interesting thing to do. And you can see whether they're auditory, visual or um, more kinesthetic which is like feeling so yeah I'll go into that more next so if you look up and right or the person who you ask the question looks up and right so they're right so if I look up like this they are imagining something so this is your this is um, visual okay so if you look up and to the right if I said if you said to me oh imagine me with blue hair obviously I haven't got blue eyes so hair so you'd have to imagine that so they would probably look up and to the right, okay? So this is something magic imagined and usually if someone's trying to think of something that's not true and it's not an actual memory, they will be looking up to the right. And if you ask them a question like, can you tell me what you did on your last holiday or what the beach was like on your last holiday, they will look up and to the left. So again, it's a visual, visual is up and left is remembered images so they will tend to look up to the left when describing whatever it is they did on their holiday. I wouldn't specifically go off this but you can sometimes tell if someone's lying maybe they might be looking up to the right if you're asking them to describe a certain aspect of something. If they are making up something that they've constructed in their head they will most likely look up to the right and this is how your brain is just programmed and if you are looking just sideways to the right like so this is for audio so if you're trying to think of for example so if you say to someone think of me with an Irish accent they will most likely look to the right and this is because they are constructing something in their head of a sound because you're not Irish so they're trying to imagine it so mostly things imagined top right so the next one is sideways to the left and this is for memories of sounds so for example a song their favorite song if you ask them to think of their favorite song in their head they will look sideways to the left and if you ask someone to for example remember what it felt like when you was on the beach touching sand or that favorite blouse of yours that is silk what did that feel like they will look down and right okay if they was to look down and left this would most likely be internal dialogue so say for example before you're going to give a speech you would perhaps go over your speech in your head um, which would be an inner dialogue that voice in your head that you can hear thanks for listening guys if you do want to learn more about some psychology of nlp then stay tuned i will be posting more in the upcoming week thanks for watching